These words will no longer be recognized by me. The word fat. Not fat as in F-A-T. I'm talking about the P-H-A-T spelling. It's a stupid catchphrase developed by urban clothes marketers in order to bilk hardworking inner city kids out of their hard earned cash. Also on the list, the word bling. What fucking cock muncher came up with this shitty term to describe an expensive lifestyle? I don't care if it was added to the Oxford Dictionary, it's not a word to me. If you ever come across someone who uses the phrase bling bling to describe something, get the fuck away from that person. It's an idiotic term used by idiotic people not familiar with the word lavish. Also, any word that ends in izzle, snizzle, fashizzle, nizzle, these are not words. This is baby talk for ghetto rats, plain and simple. Certain phrases also bother me, like sticks to your ribs. That's a meal that will stick to your ribs. Well, I'm not sure I want to eat that then. And how exactly does this meal bypass my digestive system completely and make its way to my ribs? If you can't answer that, don't use the phrase. This one is really annoying. Ma baby fada. You usually hear this from single welfare mothers in inner cities or married women who haven't come across the term husband in the dictionary yet. I can understand if you're a single mother and have a disdain for the father of your child because they ran out on you or some shit like that and therefore want to render him inconsequential through common euphemisms, disassociating the father from your life, but still recognizing him in some small way as the father of this poor bastard you brought into the world. If you're going to do this, say something like, the father of my baby, not my baby father. It makes you sound like a poorly schooled moron. And then you wonder why the baby father was beating you on a daily basis. Seriously, this is all simple shit. Try to polish up the language a bit and remove some of these moronic thoughts brought about by a limited vocabulary. I'm done here. Go home.